Hey everyone, so today we're going to talk about the hotspot on iOS. So mobile hotspots are simple, right? You just go to the settings and then you go to the hotspot here and then you just toggle it on. That's it, right? Well, yes and no. This toggle will just tell iOS that you want the hotspot on, but iOS will and can still turn off the hotspot when it sees fit. Now, if you're like me, you'll often find yourself wondering why your other devices can't find the hotspot even though I just turned this toggle on. This is because the allow to join option here isn't a true on off switch. You can actually just leave this toggle on and the hotspot will still turn itself off. So this isn't necessarily a bad thing. It does say battery, uh, but it does make for a confusing user experience. Now, based on my testing, iOS will turn off the hotspot when there is no traffic or no devices connected, and it does it very aggressively. Now, the only way to turn it back on is to go into the settings page here and then leave it on this page with this toggle on and then get all your devices connected. Or when it's decided to turn itself off, you can go to the control center here, long press this tile and then toggle this discovery back to on. Once you've done that, you'll get a couple of minutes of grace period before it again decides to turn itself off. But Apple have basically chosen to hide the true hotspot on off switch from us and they would rather iOS just handle automatically. You don't have full control over the hotspot on iOS. Now you might be wondering why is this a problem? Well recently I had some you know overseas family come over uh, and I basically have you know unlimited data plan here and it kind of made sense to just share my hotspot with them and use my data. Uh, we quickly discovered that the iPhone's hotspot just kept turning itself off. Uh, the family members throughout the day just came in and out of hotspot range, you know, because they went and did their own things, but iOS just turns off the hotspot when there's no activity. So this makes it very difficult to consistently share the mobile data. Now a workaround is to set up a family. So this will allow your hotspot or your iPhone to show up on the Wi-Fi list. So whenever they're within range of your phone, they can go to the Wi-Fi list here and then tap on your iPhone. And that will basically turn on the hotspot on your phone for them. It's still a bit annoying because they have to actively open their phone, go to the Wi-Fi list and then tap on your iPhone. And meanwhile, they'll be disconnected from the internet. This is still not perfect. If your phone is idle, your phone won't show up on this network list either. And of course, everyone needs to have Apple devices for this to work because iCloud. So I think Apple have tried to make the hotspot on iOS too smart to the point where it's become dumb. Anyway, hope this is useful and thanks for watching.